Welcome to IFAX number one stop to entertainment and trending news. Last evening, Zaribo's lady shared that she was traveling with her sons to Uganda. They arrived safely. Shakibu is also there. She has been sharing a few highlights here and there of them together, but they also visited Ivan the Don's final resting place. <laughs> What are we eating? What are we eating? And so they ended up at the late Ivan the Don's final resting place. And it seemed to have been a very emotional visit, as you could see her firstborn son a bit emotional and he stepped at the side you could see him wiping tears and the boys are also a little bit sad visiting their father's grave here. I wish that heaven had visiting hours so I could just swing by and ask you what would you do in my situation I haven't a clue how I'd even raise them what would you do you always do what's right We just talk a while until my worries disappear I'll tell you that I'm scared And as you can see, her firstborn son Pinto was, uh, was emotional visiting his father's grave and including uh Raphael as well and uh, Quincy as much as he was quiet you could clearly tell that he's uh heartbroken too it is almost six years now since Ivan the Dawn passed away but you can clearly tell that the wounds are still raw for his children he really loved his children he made sure that he was giving them the best extravagance was the name when it comes to how he will spoil his son's rot and expensive holidays um during during their birthdays, he would even go around picking all their friends, uh, giving them limousine rides, getting them to attend soccer academies back in the UK. So he really went all out when it came to his children. And so there were kids who ate life in a big spoon. And the boss lady has ensured that she has maintained whatever lifestyle that they had back then to date. And at one point, Zari, the boss lady had responded to people saying that she had inherited wealth. But what she had put out is that um, 
if you're not a smart person you will blow up all that money and so it takes a smart woman to maintain and grow the wealth that she has she has ensured that she has invested for the kids she i think maybe about a year or two she bought them apartments they continue to go to good schools the colleges are all running none has been shut down so it seems that she's doing a good job and if even the don was to look down i think he would also be proud for the work that she has managed to do the past six years everything that he left behind has continued to run apart from his house that uh, Zoe the boss lady not so long ago had shared she needs to do a little bit of renovation perhaps she already has and rented it out but so far things are running on well and clearly you can tell that the children still miss the presence of their father even as they visited him there you could tell that they still miss him his eldest son Pinto has been going to the office with uh, Zoe the boss lady he's running the ropes of the business so I think uh, his legacy will still continue, the colleges will still continue to run as his children are also learning how that business operates. We're up to date, thanks so much for watching, subscribe if you haven't, hit the notification bell, so notified once you have any new uploads, I'll see you on the next one bye bye, bye.